Good day everyone and welcome back to Tiny Glade! Alright, so we're gonna do another daily theme here and today's daily theme is Treehouse. Now I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea how we're really going to accomplish this or even if it's actually possible to do a treehouse in this game. I hope so since, you know, this is the daily theme and stuff, so let's see what it gives us here. Okay, so the way they- this is an interesting way, this is about what I expected here is to basically um, do it that way. Alright, um... Hmm. Alright, yeah, so I think we're gonna just... I know the theme is Treehouse. Um, so I'm thinking, uh, you know, I, my first thought was, um, maybe we do something like in Swiss Family Robinson or Tarzan, you know, just build some kind of really big, amazing treehouse. Um, that would be nice. Or... Um, just do a bunch of tree houses, have an entire community of people who live in tree houses. Uh, well, let, let's try, let's try the Swiss Family Robinson one at first here. Let, let's see what we can do with that. I mean, that, that's, I really don't think this is going to go too well, but, um, it, it, it's worth, a, it's worth a shot. Let, let's, let's kind of try it. So, um, we're going to place a bunch of trees around and we're going to build houses and stuff. I'm not sure whether we should put the trees first or the houses first. Um, well, I should say the parts of the tree house. Um, but yeah, let, let's try and, I'm kind of seeing this more as like an elven city built in trees above the ground kind of thing or something like that. Um, so let, let's see what we can do here. But yeah, I never thought of making a treehouse in this game, so the, the, I'm glad to see that this is, you know, kind of pushing, you know, seeing what is possible in the game. Um, down a bit. Let's also try and match the theme. It would be nice if we had, like, a theme picker here, um, you know, kind of thing, just to duplicate stuff easier. Yeah, it's the wooden one, it's the second green. Okay, wooden one... And then the second green. There we go. I'm, I mean, I'm quite happy to keep that as the same. I like to try and keep as much from the starting bit the same as possible. Alright, so we'll move this over here. Glad to see it, you know, snap together like that. That's nice. Um, we need to go down just a hair. Just, just a hair. One rabbit down. There we go. That, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. And maybe we need to move it in just a bit more. Actually, looking at this, I'm kind of coming to a realization that, um... We either... We gotta move this to, like, the right here. Let's, let's do that. There we go. We'll place a door there. I suppose a door would have to go here. We don't really have room for another window there, unless we put like a corner window. I haven't been doing much with the corner window positioning, so let's go ahead and try that out. Let, let's have some fun with some corner windows here. That's one way of... Okay, so... There we go. Alright, that is a true corner window. I didn't realize we could do it that way. There we go. Get them to match there. And we'll also place a window up here. Let's, uh, let's do two like that. that that's nice and centered. Yeah, we'll do it that way. Okay, now that we've got a second building here, and I'm actually quite you know, happy with it. It's a bit simple, maybe, but, um, oh, actually, let's do that, yeah, I like that. Alright, so, now that we've got a second building, though, we're gonna have to focus on how are we gonna do the trees underneath it. As I said, I, 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 I in my experience in this game, whenever you try and, you know, whenever you place a building like this, it gets rid of the trees, so now we're, we're entering some unusual territory here. Um... So, how, how does the trees, you know, we, we're gonna need trees of a certain size and shape, you know, in parts. We're also gonna have to have it where this thing, you know, varies, um, kind of 
and height there somewhat. Oh, that's a nice big tree. That's what we need. Let's locate that kind of in the center. Right here. I mean, ideally, we'd use the trees to hide the support pillars. So let's try and strive for that. It kind of looks like the trees are... You know, more like vines in some ways here. Ooh, that's another nice big tree. We need that. Um, I need you down here. And you, you really look... So, okay. What I'm starting to think here is that the trees kind of are growing. Um, I think I figured out how I want to position the trees and stuff to achieve. What I'm going for here is basically make it look... We can either place a bunch of trees like this just kind of hide that support pillar but at the end of the day you're, it's still going to be somewhat visible so instead what if the trees kind of just were wrapping around the pillars they the pillars serve less as structural um but more as guides for the trees themselves that wrap around them we can achieve something like that 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 would be you know pretty pretty cool place that like that Okay, um, yeah, the, these trees might be a little bit big for this section, this one in particular. So let's go ahead and set you aside, because we're, we're, we're gonna have to get a different tree. We're gonna come off of here. Oh, well, we could place a diagonal door, I guess. Would that work? Not a diagonal door. I don't think diagonal doors are a thing now. I thought they were, but maybe they aren't. Um, okay, well, that window's gonna stay there, then. Um, I think we need to kind of, like, go down a level. But that's complicated, because now we're talking stairs. Alright, so we'll keep that like that. Now, how would I want to do stairs? Now, one of the ways to do stairs in this game is to kind of just draw walls like this. Um, and then we would adjust the height of the walls. But... This is where that becomes incredibly difficult. Because we just end up with this massive wall hanging up here. Now we can hide this um, in order to go to like, you know, to have our stairs going down and stuff. We can do that. But it, it, it's still, it's going to be kind of odd. So we're, we're, we're kind of combining different tricks we've learned so far throughout the game in order to achieve what we're trying to do here. And I don't... Hmm, there's another problem we run into is the railing. Um, I don't think the railing is going to cooperate. Um, hmm. Um, so how might we do this? What if... What if this was a two-story? We get a two-story. It's hard to tell where technically we need the roof for a two-story is. Okay, we're gonna have to get this chest right here. there. We're gonna have to get rid of that. There we go. Whew. Going where, um, haven't gone before. This is actually kind of scary in a way because, um, I'm not certain if this is gonna work the way I want it to. Okay, so there's that. Um, this doesn't really feel like our second story here, but, you know, it will work. Um, we might have to do some height adjustment on this still. Uh, likewise, I'm not, well, let, let, let's just see what we get so far. Uh, yeah, I want to keep with fusing square buildings, although, I have to say, seeing this rounded section here is kind of, um, giving me some ideas. 
So we might do kind of like a rounded end. Like that. In fact, actually, let's uh, let's put this aside for now. Let's extend this building out. Let's make it nice and long. Um, yeah, that's as long as we can go, so that's what we'll set it at. Okay, we gotta adjust the height. Oh. Well, let, let, let's adjust the height that way and then adjust the height this way. We need a little bit more height down there, I think. Alright, so now what we're gonna do is we're going to take this bit here. We're gonna bring it over here. This is gonna be a flat roof section here. Um, we're gonna rate... Oh, we'll make this somewhat narrower. Narrower. Bring it up. Gonna have to do a little bit of maneuvering here. This is gonna be a balcony in here, and then we're gonna add a kind of curved balcony section just like this. We're gonna try and mimic some of the existing stuff. Yeah, let's do it like this instead. That that looks good. Okay. And so we're gonna once again we gotta place some more trees because the whole purpose is that this is supposed to be like a tree house. Okay, yeah, that, that tree is nice and big. We'll, we'll need you. Um, right in there, kinda. Again, ability to rotate trees and other objects would be very helpful with this. Okay, so I don't want to call this done, because to be honest, I'm not fully happy with it. I feel like more is needed. I'm just not sure how to expand it next. I kind of like having this, um, like, balcony area over here. But at the same time, I feel like, um, another structure is needed. I tried messing around with, like, a rounded tower there. I didn't like the results of it. Um, the rounded towers just don't seem to fit this. This is a very angular, um, design, if you will. Specifically right angle. Um, so, yeah, we're gonna try. Let's try placing a building here. Um, yeah, it's treating that like a kind of walkway. That's what we wanted. Good. Um, height on this needs to go up a bit more. There. And we'll raise this up to two. We'll bring this out here. Like, so, that's fine. And of course, gotta raise the roof because this is a very steep roof. We're, we're going to do some kind of steep roofs here. Okay, so it's starting to really come together here, I think. Um, I don't want to overbuild in the area, but it does need to feel more complete. So I'm trying to kind of reach that point where we have a satisfactory kind of, like, conclusion to it. I think we're getting there at a good pace. I think we're almost at that point. Um, so what I'm gonna do is this one here is gonna merge onto there. That's gonna provide a nice little intrigue bonus here to this build. Um, we'll place it where it's centered this way. Okay, that's fine over there, and that looks mostly good. We need to widen you just a touch. There we go. That's where we want you to be. And you come into there nicely. And... I'm not sure if we want this any longer or not. Uh, but we're going to add on to here as well. Ooh. Not quite what I expected from you, but I'm not necessarily disappointed. Yeah, I was afraid of this. So this is where we run into a issue of not being able to have this piece extend far enough for where I'd like it to. I'm gonna have to do two sections of it. So yeah, I think this is pretty much what it's going to be. So I'm going to add the last of like the windows and stuff. 
and then we're going to take a look at the finished product. Well, there it is. I'm not sure if this counts really as a tree house, uh, per se, uh, but then again, this is, I feel, as close as we can really get to tree houses in this game. At least, you know, with the current version of the game, version 1.10.2. Um, maybe the developers, you know, will one day consider, you know, other ways of doing this and stuff, but um, this is about as close to the spirit I feel that we can get to doing a tree house and stuff. Um, there's a lot of things I like. I mean, I really like how we kept this bit here um, going. I like this initial stuff here. Um, the rest, I admit, feels a little bit maybe too open, um, a little bit too big. Um, I think that, that if I had put some more little stuff in, um, that could have helped. Uh, definitely so. So had some of these bigger structures, but then have some little structures coming off of them in some way. Maybe did more wraparound uh, balconies, kind of like what this one has. Because uh, th this was, you know, the, the starting building was a good starting building for inspiration-wise. So I guess I could have had, you know, these connected like so. Uh, that could have probably helped. Uh, so yeah, there's definitely some room for improvement in this design, I will definitely say. Um, the other thing is that, well, this is kind of a time thing, but I did, you know, I kind of did my best here with this. I could have put a little bit more effort into hiding the pillars themselves to make it look uh, like the trees are there. The problem is if you do too good of a job, you get the leaves clipping through here. So that kind of takes away from it. Um, really, you just need a lot of these big trees. Well, I guess this was a big tree. I could have used this somewhere. Um, but yeah, a lot of these trees, you know, kind of help. Uh, but at the same time, you, you can only go so far before you start getting leaves clipping into the building. So it, it's actually very hard. Um, the water feature was kind of an afterthought, admittedly. And I could have done more with it. Um, maybe have had, like a river running off this way and a bigger lake over here to make it more pronounced. Uh, maybe even have this entire thing kind of like an island. That could have been done a thing. I also, once again, this is one of those things where I wish we could do like a creek or something running down here and then have a little waterfall. I think that would have been uh, kind of neat. Duck. Um, I was just enjoying scaring the fish there. <laughs> but yeah, um, overall, I think it turned out better than I had hoped, I, because to be honest, how, as I said, how how do you really create, you know, a tree house in this game? Well, um, this is a good attempt. You know, maybe I'll take this challenge on again at some point, and I'll figure out a way of doing th some things better and stuff. The last thing I will say is that, um, yeah, I, 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 I kind of wish I did more of the multi-level stuff, because having this above this like this is quite nice. I guess I could have had this one up here instead of down here, um, you know, and did, did more stuff like this. Um, but 
I, w I, I wish there was a way to do this bit here better, because this, this took a lot of time, and I'm still not fully satisfied with the results of this, like, connecting bridge. I'm fine with the pillars there like that for the bridge, but yeah, the rest of it needs to look like a treehouse type thing. So yeah, let me know what you think of uh, the build in the comments below, and would you like to live in this little treehouse city? I mean, I, I haven't found the way you get down yet, so I'm gonna go with no personally. But let me know what you think in the comments below.